What's up Future Lust here and I have a new video for you guys. First off, take a look at this. If you look at this, it looks like another nice shot, a nice drone video that you might see on YouTube or any commercial. And then if you look at this picture, it looks like a nice woman walking down the street. Or how about this? This picture right here looks like it could be a commercial. But these three videos have something in common that you might not expect. None of them are real. They are part of a new video algorithm and AI that was developed by OpenAI and it looks so real that it, it could fool the human eye. It's getting so close, it's getting scary. The level of realism is, is mind-blowing. I mean, only a year ago we were, we were here with this Will Smith eating spaghetti and it's become kind of a meme at that time but look where we are now it's, it's gotten crazy I mean if you look closely you can see that there are things that give it away that is not real but if you were just looking and not looking out for the AI then you could easily be fooled and that's why I could totally understand why OpenAI is not fully opening this out until after the elections. Now this thing isn't perfect. It can do things like confuse left or right or have someone bite into the cookie and the cookie doesn't have a bite mark or someone running left instead of right. But the level of detail is astounding. To give more info, it is a text to video model and it could generate videos up to a minute long. That is crazy. It used to be five seconds and it seems to keep going bigger and bigger. The secret sauce to this apparently is that Sora could simulate the physical world to some extent. Currently they are granting access to a select group of artists, designers, filmmakers, etc. and red teamers to access the risk and see how it affects society. But as you can see, there's been a lot of posts on Twitter of different things. You see puppies, you see old style films, you see kittens, you see all kinds of things. So it'd be crazy to see where this goes in the future. It could be disruptive to jobs, hopefully not too much. I'm very skeptical of it disrupting Hollywood or big movies, but it is likely disruptive of stock video. So we'll keep up to date and see how things go. And Bye for now. Like and subscribe and I'll have more coming for you very soon.